Dag on it. That's where I used to have all my chickens up through there. Wow, man. I've been out of here God, 20, 20 some years, maybe. I used to have a pen right there where I had my, my hatches and I used to breed all my birds there. <clears throat> I was on a tobacco barn. Look at this mess. Look at my old trailer. Place went to crap. I don't want to go down there too much. God, my yard used to be beautiful. And now look at this crap. Wow, they really... It's funny how the landlords, when I got to where I couldn't afford to live here by myself when the old lady left, <clears throat> the landlords made a big deal out of it and everything. And and this the place was real nice. I mean, all the grass was cut. There was flowers everywhere. I had a little garden down there. I had birds all over the beautiful game fowl all over the place. And after I left, one of their family members moved in here, and I hear they didn't stay very long. But look at this place now. That was a nice trailer. And I'm not just saying that. I mean it. It's funny going back after so many years and seeing how things have changed. My God. There's a neighbor's farmhouse. That was the original farmhouse over this 500 acres that were right behind here. Look at everything getting green. Look at all the plants coming up, getting all the green on the on the leaf, on the stems and the branches and everything now. Look at my trailer. Oh, there used to be nothing but grass and flowers and plants, and I had built stone walls around them two big trees right there. And now look at this nasty mess. Yeah, they really done good by getting me out of here. That's the longest time I ever lived in one place was five years living here. Jeez. This was all grass up here. There was a little retainment pond up here. I guess the puppy went up underneath the truck. My sister's trying to get it. Came all the way to North Carolina to get a dog. Now I'm going to get some chickens. Retaining pond was right here. Oh man, you can't even see nothing anymore. You got any water in it? It's terrible. I can't believe it got like this. So you can't go home. Literally, can't go home here. Just thought I'd show y'all around a little bit. This is where I used to live here in uh, Rougemont, North Carolina. I used to love it here. But after the lady went running around on me and decided one day she was going to leave, that was it. Well, have a nice day.